really in my shot right now, and it's bothering me. It's like bubble wrap, but not. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is the Bearcat Breakdown. Ooh. Oh my goodness. What do you guys want to listen to? Oh, I got it. It's completely Are you clean. What's the volume? Can I wear these? The roads are really slick. Watch out this bird. Oh my goodness. You were cutting that one close, weren't you? I mean, wow. No reason to slow down for the birds. <laughs> oh wow, my goodness. <laughs> Ruthless. So how's volleyball gonna do this season? I think we'll be good. It's good. You gonna miss the seniors? Yeah. The laugh goes on. It's off. Put your goggles on. It's go time. Go Bears! I'm gonna do this now. Ben. <coughs> the theme. <coughs> Homecoming is School of Rock. It's yeah. gonna be that whole week. Is that Monday through Friday? Uh, yeah, that's Monday through right. Friday. Seniors, y'all got Queen. 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 Oh. Juniors, y'all got Journey. 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 Oh. Sophomores, ACDC. ACDC. ACDC! Woo! Oh. Ben, why don't you read off the dress up days? Well, Noah, I would love to. All right. Dress up days. Starting January 28th, Monday, we got Dream On Pajama Day. Again, January 29th, welcome to the jungle. Dress like your favorite animal. Woo! January 30th, I love rock and roll. Boom. Dress like your favorite rock star. Amen. January 31st, go. Crazy train! Crazy train, wear your craziest outfit, makeup, and hair. I look good. February 1st! Last day homecoming. Smells like teen spirit. Dude, that's gonna smell awful. B-O. Red and black. You have red and black. February 1st is the game. At 7.30. At 7.30! Boys. Take on. Valley. Who? It's View. It's Valley View. Valley View. Go Bears. Go Bears. December 22nd. ASU's Conversations Convention Center. Go Bearcats. Woo! Go Bearcats. Uh, the boys take on Batesville in the NDA tournament. The boys take on Batesville. Oh, sorry. Go Bearcats. Go Bearcats. Homecoming game February 1st against. Who do they play? Bates. Who? Bates. Bates. Batesville Bombers. Batesville Bombers. <laughs> <laughs> Ah. Howdy, Mr. Clare Day. Would you like some sweet tea? I don't have any of that. What are you doing? Taking apart carburetor on a generator. Sounds like fun. I think Noah has a question. We're here once again with Mr. Clare Day. So, Mr. Clare Day. Is Santa Claus real or fake? Well, why wouldn't Santa Claus be real? I mean, nobody's ever seen him, but that doesn't make him not real. I've never seen Bigfoot or the Loch Ness Monster, but I still believe. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> Wow. Check it. Wow! Tanya! Tanya! Hello? Tanya! Tanya? Tanya! 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 Hello? 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 Tanya. 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 Ho, ho, ho. You're gonna miss Monday's Country Fried Steak and Gravy. Mmm. Tuesday. Tuesday will be manager's choice. Mmm. That's gonna be a surprise. Chicken and waffles on Wednesday. Mmm. Thursday, bacon cheeseburger. Mmm. And then we're out of school. Mmm. Ho, ho, ho. Have a Merry Christmas. 
So can I take it tomorrow? You can take the quiz tomorrow. You can take it during seventh period. You can take the quiz right now. You can do what you want because you are Mr. Garcia. Weatherman extraordinaire. So tomorrow. Would you want to take it tomorrow? Yeah. Would Wednesday work better for you? Yeah. It's like a ring toss at the fair, but not only. And it's underwater. But you don't have to hold your breath. You know who would like this? Claire Day. Oh. He's all about the flat earth thing. This is a perfect example of the flat earth. Yeah. That's sweet. Are you allowed to have that in school? That looks like a pointy object. Grab that rock file. The English teachers really don't like it. Hold on. When you're trying to talk and record, but you're smacking your gum, they discriminate. Watch your mouth. Hey, right, we're about to get this dub right here. Junior high's out here about to tear them up. We got high school next, dub season. We're here, dubbing. So what we see here is the Brooklyn Bearcats catching these big fat W oh and eating that. Brooklyn Bearcats at the Brooklyn Junior High. Go get on your weather deck, dude. Go get on your weather deck. Wet Willie. Wet Willie. Cut it. Ah. Got two seconds left and we're ahead. Go Bearcats. It's a dub! It's a dub! J-L-A-N-D, Brooklyn Bearcats. Go Bearcats. All right, we're with Trevor Blankenship. How you doing? I'm doing well. How are you? I'm doing good. What do you think about the Brooklyn Bearcats? I think uh, we're going to do well in the end. We're going to come back and we're going to conquer the win. So uh, hopefully the, our dreams will come true. What's your biggest dream? Probably to like buy, buy like a jet ski. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. And uh, I don't know, fly with it or something. Well, what are you doing tonight? I'm actually going home and, and hopefully going to bed. What about you? I'm gonna, probably going to do the same thing, you know. Some people might know me as T-Bone. Well, we're going to move on to the next man. Thanks, T-Bone. What's up? So what, 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 are you, what are your thoughts? That's it. All right, uh, uh, yeah. What grade are you in? Ninth. Ninth grade. You're a tall ninth grader. Yeah, I actually play on the team. Yeah, I'll take you a big dub. Yeah. It was a pleasure. Matt, Matt. Uh, Matt, Matt. Matt, Matt. Hey, one of the best junior high basketball players we got right here. Matt, Matt. Matt, Matt, tell us about the game. The high school game? The junior high game. Tell us about junior high game. It was a close game. I mean, we played good. We competed well. We could have did a little bit. But who better. won? We did. Go Bears. Go Bears. What's your name? Joseph, right? I'm Noah. Joseph, you interviewed me. All right. How do you like this job? I get to meet a lot of people. You like the camera action, don't you? Yeah, you yeah. You play any sports? No. I play dance. William, come on. This is uh, Wet Willie with your weather. Monday, sunny. Tuesday, sunny. Oh, wait, um, clouds. There will be some clouds up in the sky. Big clouds. Wednesday, sunny as well with clouds. Thursday, sunny with clouds as well. Friday will be a little bit warmer than, you know, we think. I think uh, that's what I think. I mean, I'm really not sure. <laughs> Saturday will be sunny and cloudy as well. Smithfield just gave me a report. Sunday will be hell. Falling down, big chunks, big chunks of rocks. Be careful, wear helmets out there. Could get knocked out. Out. Okay, break down. What is the cheer team practice? So we're going to a uh, cheer practice, about to see what they have in them, uh, see what they can do. We're looking for uh, some serious stunts, uh, some good cheering going on. We want them to work us to death in the other uh, time that we're there. So we're gonna see what they got. We'll be there in a minute. Let's hit it. The cheerleaders are way more flexible than these boys are. These boys are so not flexible at all. Oh, this is pitiful. And Bradley's the worst. Oh yeah, back bends. Let's go. You gotta get your heads off the ground. Uh, oh, this is pitiful. Awesome. Let's go on to the back stretches. Um, excuse me, fellas. Have y'all bought raffle tickets from us? I bought one. Oh my gosh. Wait a minute. You said cheer's not a not a sport. Well, you said that. I heard it was Bradley. Forty burpees, Bradley. Oh, we're almost ready for the fun stuff. Bradley's the only one that needs his back stretch because he's the flyer today. No, it's not illegal. You're just a wimp. You just play soccer. Hey, the camera can't see him. Bradley says the struggle is real. Oh, look, and Bradley couldn't hardly get off the ground. Bella is fixing to demonstrate the stunt y'all are going to do. Here we go. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five. 
There you go. Bradley said he can't do it. Can you do that, Bradley? I don't think so. You're fixing to try. Let's go. Let's go. It's got to be scarier than kicking a ball around. <laughs> oh, man. That didn't even get off the ground. This is really a strongman competition. Okay, who, who's going to dare do it? Oh, look. Oh, my gosh. They're saying they don't want to do it. But they say cheer is not a sport. I do not, I'm not, I do not feel safe. I can't do it. <laughs> Get out. Miss Moore. Hi. Cheer coach. Uh, we just got done with cheer practice. Tell us a little bit about cheer. What are, what are some of the performances you guys do? We generally have a uh, one big routine that we take and compete with, and it includes an opening, and it has some tumbling, and a pyramid, and a cheer. And that's what we usually take uh, to our competitions, and we'll perform that in front of the school also at various games. And we try to put together other routines on the side, but this year we were kind of behind and have really only gotten to that one. Cool. Well, thank you, Miss Moore. What is your favorite part about cheer? You just experienced it. Okay. I dare you to neck We're going on a secret mission. Uh, secret mission. Oh. Nick! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> no, uh, no, 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 <laughs> Fixed it. Now I'm not stupid. So we're here with Miss Susan, the head secretary of Brooklyn High School, and she has a little message for you students out there. This is the student check in and check out. Check in, check out. The proper way to sign into the office. You have your student name. Mm. There is a time in. There is a time out. The time in is when you get here if you're late. You don't sign in the time out. The time out is if you check in. Out. Wow. This is the improper way. Wow. This is what I have to deal with. See all these scribbles? Because people don't understand time in, time out. It's a relatively simple, simple. And these form. are high school students. These yeah, are high school students. Oh, you yeah. go late, okay. Time in, time out. Name, grade, time in, or time out. Wow, I really need some shampoo. Well, how about this, Noah? The Bear Cat Breakdown Cleanser. It doesn't only cleanse your body, but it cleanses your soul.